Hello again and welcome back to our course on Project 2019. In this section we're going to take a look at notes. Now notes can be applied to tasks or resources and they're used for a number of different reasons. Amongst the most popular reasons for using notes is that they are a means of communicating with other people. So for example, if you're working on a project with others and you say want to just leave a note for somebody, such as a piece of information or something that's been agreed or maybe a warning, something to be careful of, then a note is a really good way of doing this. So let's take a look at adding a note to one of the tasks on the wedding plan. So I'm in Gantt chart view and let's suppose that I've got a contact name and number for somebody who can print really, really nice wedding invitations. So I'm going to go down to task 19, send out invitations. I'm going to right click and one of the options in there is notes. Note also that up on the task tab, if I just switch to that, in the properties group, we also have a notes button there. But I'm going to use right click in this case and click on notes. Now when I enter a note, it's actually one of the tabs in the task information dialog box. So let me enter the content of the first note. So there's my note. Now there are some formatting options here, not particularly dynamic options, but there are a few. So for instance, if you look at some of the buttons here, you've got a format font button. You can align and you have your left align, center align and right align. You've got bulleted list and you also have insert object, which means that you can even include a picture with your note. But one useful thing to bear in mind with notes, as I'll show you in just a moment, is that it's a good idea to word or format the note in such a way that the beginning of the note gives you a good idea of what the note is about. And I'll explain that to you a little bit better in just a moment. So let's click on OK. And there's my note. Now, once I've added a note, the note icon appears in the column that I have on the left there, the information column. Now, if I hover over, you can see that note. So in this case, because my note is fairly short, I can see all of it. Ordinarily, if you have a much longer note, you'll only be able to see the first few lines. So that is why I say put the most important information at the start of the note so you don't have to go into the note to see the full details. Now, if I see that a task has a note and I want to open it up, obviously, if I just double click on the task and go to the notes tab, I can see that note. And if you're wondering how you delete a note, so maybe you make a mistake or you don't need that note anymore, there is no delete note button per se. All you need to do is highlight the text, hit the delete key to remove it, and the note will disappear. And finally, just one other thing, I mentioned that you can insert notes for resources, and I'm sure you could probably work out how to do that for yourself, but let's go through it anyway. I'm gonna jump across to the resource sheet, and you can see I already have a note in there for the photographer, but it's pretty much the same process. I can click on any of these, right click and go to notes. And I can then add my note into here. And one final thing to mention now, just before I finish this section, when you come to printing, which we're gonna to come to in the next section, one of the options when you're printing certain types of information from Project 2019 is whether to print the notes or not. So that's one to watch out for in coming sections. But as far as notes are concerned, that's it for now. I will see you in the next section.